and welcome back, ladies and Joes. This is Friday 22, and I'm coming right back at you with another RimWorld video. K picking up right where we left off. Uh, not, not two seconds away, but maybe a week for you. But um, let's go ahead and um, put this stuff in here so it doesn't look nearly as bad. Ba -ba where is it? I don't need that. I just need, I need a heater in here. And I'm going to need winter has begun. All right. Well, I think what I might want to do, I did this on my own. Um, I think I probably am going to want to do this again is set up a, um, can't talk. Oop, oop. There you go. Like a standing lamp in here. Um, what I'm going to need to do is probably end up setting up a uh, place where we can grow um, some food during the winter because yeah, that's probably what we're going to need to end up doing. So that means we're going to need to kill these guys off. See, if you're eating on the ground, that's your own dang fault. Like, you had the opportunity to do that. Armstrong looks all good. Up the immunity, so we're going to start talking to him. Actually, medicine is phenomenal. 77%. Try to get you on our side. Let's take a look at him first. Capable of firefighting, but that's okay. Not too overly concerned about it. Let's get rid of these. Prison break. Let's just do that. So he doesn't shoot anything in here. Where is... Neuratrix? Halfway across the map. So he's down. Capture him again. Oh, you're not going to be able to get through the dang wall. Luckily, we got them blocked. They can't go anywhere, but... uh, Might lose a couple. Yep, like, there's one down. Where's Miratrix? Dude, where are you? Can you not move any faster? Got another one down. There we go, and we're gonna rescue Lee, and then now we're gonna rescue, actually capture these guys again. So nice of you to show up, my friend. There they go, just like that, all done. Egan, you're good to go. A bunch of weapons laying all over the place. And I will be right back. Alrighty, and I'm back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Alright, so starting to work on the parkas. Egan's already took off the first parka. Ooh, it's cold in there. Put a heater in there. Aim it for 68. 68 degrees. I'm about to come off with another parka, which is good, so. Yorkshire Terrier. And are joining the and are joining the colony. All twenty of them. Jeez. Um great. Well, you know my rules. Stay out of my kitchen. Definitely gonna need to... What the heck? Where's Lee? Lee is like... 
Lee needs to rest first off. Rest until healed. Oh my goodness. Yeah, bud, you're gonna need it. <laughs> okay, and I need you to capture capture what I might do is move a couple of them to the crypto sleep caskets, at least the ones like cat and yeah, that's basically what I'm gonna do. Until I can get this up and running, so we'll move cat to one and we'll move another one there too. So we can get it to where we don't have to worry about them. Oh my gosh, I just put it there. What the hey? She's going to go just go crazy until that Now we're going to sit for a couple days. <sighs> Let's at least get them treated, so... Yeah, you're gonna... No, no, you're not gonna arrest. You're gonna prioritize treating. Nope, now she went crazy. So many bad things going on. This is kind of loud, too. Options, game volume. Turn that down a touch. Now you just dang messed up your place too. I think Meritrix is just like bleeding out all over the place, yeah. 51% moderate. 54. She's lost 54% of her blood. Okay, yeah. You need to... Crap. Lee's gotta get out of the bed. That's what she's gotta do. And you've gotta go in it, because you're worse than Lee is. Lee's just loss of blood. Okay, they're both about to snap. Oh, is this a... Okay, I was about to say, I was like, no, no, no. Okay, the bleeding's done. You can stop treating her. These guys are starving. Because Lee's the warden. Jeez. Meritrix is fine. Gotten two infections. Uh, 
Ay, ay, ay. Got the Parkers now, though, so we're doing quite swell. All right, guys, this is going to be the end of this episode. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Until next time. Uh-oh. Till next time. Bye-bye. And howdy ho, ladies and Joes. This is Ferry22, and I'm coming right back at you. That's a nice little clump pick pickup. I'm coming right back at you with another video. And my poor Yorkshire Terriers are dying. But if they're halfway across the uh, universe, then I don't quite mind. Anywho. Um, they've got to make their way this way if they want to survive. Why have you gone crazy? <sighs> Guys, you have a table to use. You just... Crap. Oh, this is going to get super ugly. I don't have time for this. They're too busy fighting each other. We can't fight the people that's here. Meritrix is down. This could get really ugly. I'm just going to let him go crazy. Stop. Great. And now they're going crazy. Stop, you jerk. Well, now they're both down. Well, this could be the end of this colony. I'll be right back to find out what happens. Oh, now he's attacking someone else. Let's just find out what happens. Got people coming too. Samantha's dead though, is my only good convincer person. They're probably just going to bleed out on the floor. Jeez. Come back when something interesting happens. Oh, now he's fighting the traitor. Now he's down. Oh, well, at least he's done going crazy, but, uh... Yeah, this is, this is basically the end, I believe. Unless they magically get better, which I don't think will happen. Be right back. Yep, so there goes Meritrix. Meritrix has died. I believe this is the end of the colony. Well, this was short-lived. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Until next time, take care. This is Froggy, and I'm out.